Look how staticky my hair is. Like, oh my god. Look how staticky my hair is. Like, oh my god. Hey guys, so today I am very excited because I have a huge Ulta haul to share with you guys. I went to Ulta, I got three gift cards for Christmas, so I had $130 to spend and I was so excited. So I went to Ulta and picked up a bunch of stuff. I discovered this brand called Sleek and I got, but I picked up a bunch of stuff from them because I like discovered this brand while I was there. I've never, I've heard of it, but I didn't even think that they like had it here. So I saw it and I got so much stuff from them. So I'm just gonna pick in here and show you guys what I got. But yes, I picked up a bunch of stuff from Ulta and I'm so excited because I love getting new makeup. So first we have this Tarte eyeshadow palette in Double Duty Beauty in Leave Your Mark. And it looks like this. It has really cute little kissies all over it. And then oh, it looks like this. And I thought this was so pretty and I really like all the colors in it. And I feel like they're all wearable. And the only thing is there isn't like a matte crease color in here. So you would have to go in with other palettes. But I thought this was so pretty and I really liked it. Then I got this Buxom Mascara Duo because it came with a full size Buxom Mascara and a mini one. And I love, love, love this mascara. I think it is like the best mascara ever and I love the wand on it. So this is a really nice mascara if you're looking for a new one. I really love this and the Too Faced Better Than Sex. They're both really good. Then I got this. This is from Makeup Revolution. All I have from them too is I have like a baked highlighter but I don't have much from them either. And I picked up... I think I picked up something else from them. I don't know. But this is like a Kylie Lip Kit dupe. It's called the Retro Luxe Matte Lip Kit. It comes with a lip pencil and a liquid lipstick. And it's in the shade Rain. And this is really cute. So, Okay, this is the liner. It's all like sealed. So I'm not going to swatch it because that will take forever. But the liquid lipstick. If I could get it out. I swatched it earlier. It's this really pretty light pink shade. It's so pretty. So that's it right there. You can tell I was already doing swatches earlier. So that's what that looks like. Okay, then I got, you guys know I cannot go into Ulta and not buy a TARDIS lip paint. So I got two new TARDIS lip paints. This is my all-time, all-time number one favorite lip product is TARDIS lip paints. So I got the shade Bling. Oops. Which is like this really nice. I got deeper colors this time. So this is a nice bear. I thought this would be really good for the winter time. So that is bling right there. And then I also got, what did I just do with it? Oh, I put it up here. In the shade Obsessed. And this one, they're kind of similar, but they're different, I swear. This one is more like, I don't know. Here, I'll swatch them. Okay, this one is Obsessed on top. So Obsessed is more purpley and Bling is more of a red, if you can see that. Then I got two of these new Maybelline City Mini palettes. I got Rooftop Bronzes and Brunch Chill Brunch Neutral. So this is what these look like. They're really, really, really pretty. This one's nice, like, pinky, rosy tones, like... And then this one is nice bronze, pretty shade. So I'm excited to try these out. I haven't heard much about them. Then I got another thing for Makeup Revolution. This is the Redemption Eyeshadow Palette Iconic 2. <coughs> Sorry. And this kind of reminded me of the Naked 2 palette. I don't know if it's just me, but I think it looks like the Naked 2 palette. Like, the colors are very similar. And they had, I'm pretty sure they had three of these. So they're probably supposed to be like the Naked 1, 2, and 3. So, and I'm pretty sure this was like $7. Or it was under $10. It was something crazy cheap. Then I got this new Benefit. I haven't heard anyone talk about this, so I don't know if this is like super new, but I haven't heard anyone talk about this. It's the Benefit Professional Pearl Primer, so it says it targets pores and dullness, so basically it's like the Benefit Professional, but it's a illuminating one, you know, it's called the Pearl Primer, so it's a little bit more, not matte, it has a little bit of a more dewy finish, and I put this on the back of my hand and it was so nice, so I am so excited to try that out. Then this is new. This is a Maybelline Color Tattoo Eye Chrome. I have not heard anyone talk about these, so I don't know if these are really new. This is in the shade Gilded Rose, and it's like a champagne pinky color, if you can see it right there. This is really pretty, and I thought this would be nice. It kind of reminded me of the Stila 
you know, the new, like, glitter liquid eyeshadows. It kind of reminded me of that. So, I'm excited to try that out. Um, then I got three. I also can't go into Ulta and not buy NYX lip products. So, I got three. I've never heard of these or seen these before. So, they are called Super Clicky Matte Lipsticks. So, I got the shade OVS. Like, it's O-B-V-S. Um, on the DL. And empowered so that's what these three look like I think they're super pretty and they're really cool you just basically like click up the bottom and it makes it come out the top like slowly but surely so these are awesome and they're really nice I'm excited to see how those wear if they stay like if they um have transfer or anything because they say that they're matte so I'm hoping that they'll stay on then I got two little single eyeshadows so first is the essence the metal shadow in vanilla brilliance and I thought this was so pretty, like, as a lid shade or a highlight shade. I would use this as a highlight on my face, honestly. Look how pretty it is. And then this, I'm so excited about. Catrice. This is another brand that I didn't know we had at Ulta. But this is the Catrice Liquid Metal Eyeshadow in the shade Satina Vander Woodson. And, oh my gosh, you guys, this is literally gorgeous. Look how beautiful that is. It is like blinding and look how cool it looks in the tube. It's like, if you can see, it's like rippled. Oh my god, this is so cool. I cannot wait to use that. I'm so excited about that. Then I think the rest is sleek stuff. So I'll start off with this highlighting palette. It's all gold. It has really nice packaging. It's mirrored. And this is in Solstice. And it has a cream highlight right here. And then it has these three beautiful highlight shades just to swatch these. They're so pretty. So that's them right there. And I thought this was really, really nice. And I'm excited to try that. Because I love trying new highlighters. Oh my goodness. Then I got this. Um, oh, this is from Makeup Revolution. Not um, Sleek. So this is a Makeup Revolution selfie palette. And if you can see, I don't know if my camera will do it. But it like, yeah, okay. And it comes with a free eye primer. So we'll have to see if that does anything. But. It looks like this. Oh, wrong side. Ooh. And it comes with this little thing that says all the shades, so I feel like I have to keep this if I use it in a video. But these are what the colors look like. They're so, so pretty, and they're all really pigmented. I swatched it in the store, you know, I, like, snuck it open and was like, oh, my God, you guys, I just dug my finger into that. Wow. Okay, well, there's a swatch of it. Look at what I just did to it. I suck. But I opened it up in the store because I was like, let me see if these are pigmented. And I, they were, and I'm really excited. Ew, but I'm so mad I just got this all over myself. Okay, then I have this. This looks so cool. Guys, I saw the new Too Faced. Um, I don't know what it's called, but it's like the gold chocolate bar. And I wanted to buy it so bad, but I didn't. I don't know. Tell me if you guys are going to buy it or not. I didn't know how I felt. I wanted to buy it because I have all the chocolate bar palettes, so I felt like I needed it. But I was like, oh my god, it's $50. That was like an entire gift card. And I was like, I can get so much stuff with $50 if I go over to the drugstore section. So I decided not to get it, but I don't know. I might end up buying it. But this is the Makeup Revolution Bronze and Glow Chocolate Bar. So look how cool this looks. It looks like a chocolate bar with like melting gold. Doesn't this look so cool? And it has a bronzer and a highlighter. And I like that the bronzer is matte and the br highlighter is shimmery. That's like exactly what I want. So, and this bronzer looks, if I could get this stupid thing off, this bronzer looks really light. Like it's not too dark. And the highlight is really pretty as well. I'm running out of room. So that's the bronzer and that's the highlighter. So I thought this looked really nice and I love, love, love the packaging. Then I got two mascaras from them, and these both have really cool ones, so I have to show you guys. So I got the Sleek Full Fat Lash Mascara and the Extra Long Lashes Mascara. So I think one is for, this one is for volume, and then the long lashes is obviously for length. So, okay. So this is what it looks like. It's the Sleek Full Fat Lash Mascara. And look at this wand. Is that not the coolest thing ever? I was like, oh my god, I have to. <gasps> no. Okay. Ew. I was like, I have to try this. The wand looks so cool. And then this one had a really cool wand, too. Whenever I see a cool wand, I just, like, buy it. Like, I can't. They have plastic on them. Okay. And then this one is the extra long lashes. Ooh, and this one looks really cool, too. 
See how like long the bristles are? Look how cool. Oh my god, I'm so excited to try both of these. I love, love, love trying new mascaras. So I'm so excited to try those out. And then I got this, and this reminded me of the Cover Effects, like, you know those crazy pigmented liquid highlighters from Cover Effects? I really, I'm pretty sure that's the brand. I might be wrong. But I really, really, really want to try those because this, like, isn't as blinding as that. But it is still, like, the same concept. So this is the Liquid Highlighter in Unicorn Elixir, and it's that same type of concept where it's, like, liquid drops of highlighter. And I will... Okay, let me just... And can you see how it's like holographic? Like it really is like a unicorn. Like, oh my god, this is so cool. But then when you blend it out, it kind of is just like glitter. Like it still has some like sheen to it, so it is pretty under highlighter. But it's really purpley. I don't know. But I'm really excited to try this out. I think this is really cool. But I really do want to get that one from Cover Effects because I want it so bad. But it's like I think it's at least $40. So I was like, mm. But I do want to get that eventually. But that is everything I got at Ulta. So... I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Sorry it was a little long, but it wasn't too long. Normally these are like 20 minutes long. So, I hope you guys enjoyed. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe and be sure to leave me video requests down below because I always need video ideas. And I hope you enjoyed. I love you all so much.